a quick reminder, don't forget to subscribe to the channel and turn on notifications so you don't miss out on when I upload a video. Also, check out our new community tab for updates on the channel. Hi guys, it's a Geeky Chick here and today I am going to do a quick tutorial and I might start doing these regularly because I do get asked a lot of questions about how to record, how to screenshot, how to edit, how to make thumbnails, just all of the little things that go into uh, making a YouTube video or YouTube channel that can sometimes be more difficult than it needs to be. But yeah, okay, so I have an iPhone and so most of my tutorials will be geared towards iPhone users just because that's what I have, but I am going to put in a list of screen recorders for Android that you can download from your app store and record straight from your phone. So with the iPhone, there is a screen recorder built in now. It wasn't always like this, but with the mo with some of the more recent updates, it was added and you can record your screen straight from your phone. You can also record your voice with like the built-in mic or you can use a headphone for your mic. So to get to the screen recorder, first go into your settings and go to control center. When you're in control center, you wanna tap customize controls and you see right here, I have screen recording, but if you haven't already done this, your screen recording will be some here, somewhere on this list. So find it, uh, press the green button and add it to your list. I like to keep it at the top. It's probably the one I, that and like an alarm or something is probably what I use the most. That actually is probably screen recording and a flashlight. But so then I put screen recording at the top. Um, swipe up with your finger. If you guys know, you see I'm swiping up with my finger from the bottom of the screen. And right here to the right of dot connector, you see where the little record button is. Now I have some screenshots for you uh, because mine is gonna be grayed out because I have my phone uh, connected to my computer and I'm using uh, computer software to record my phone screen. And I'll make a video about the computer software, but that's like a separate video. This is how to record your uh, iPhone screen for free, built in, you know, no nothing else required. But because I'm using something else to record the screen, I can't show you guys the, the full menu. Let's go into the game. When I'm recording, I like, before I even start, I like to already be in my game. And if you don't have a lot of software to edit or you don't wanna spend a lot of time editing, here's some tips I would say. Turn off your notifications so you don't have to edit that out, especially if a text message or something might come in that's very personal. Um, when you're screen recording, it's gonna record everything. So try not to go anywhere where you need to put in any passwords or any emails or something that you don't want to show up. If those things do, you have to edit it out and I will make um, a tutorial if you guys want. Let me know right now in the comments if you would like me to do um, just a quick overview on how to edit straight from your phone and then I can show you guys how I edit on my computer, the software that I use. And I use software that is way cheaper than a lot of the standard software a lot of YouTubers will tell you that they use. Because so I like to be in the game ready, especially if I'm using the built-in screen recorder. And then you're gonna swipe up, and then you're going to hold down. You can do this, you can, do, you can just hit record, or you can hold down for the settings. When you hold down, I'm gonna show you guys a screenshot of what will pop up. You'll get, um, it'll say, what I'm waiting for, my, <laughs> it'll say screen recording, and at the bottom it says stop start recording you can tap that but if you want the microphone off or microphone on so this is if you want to do a voice recording with your game or you want it off now i usually have my microphone off when i'm recording like this but i have done it before recording from my phone when my computer was down and i used my headphones and sometimes i like to turn the in this is what you do if you're gonna use the headphone, turn your in-game sound down. So you would go into your game and go to sounds and most games will have this type of setting. Turn down the music and your sound effects so it won't overpower your audio because when I record on my computer, I get two separate files. I get my iPod sound and then I get my mic sound. But when you're using this built-in and you're trying to do it, this is not gonna be necessary. It's not gonna be separated. It's gonna be like all one file. I believe so, yes. So you want to turn down your master volume or turn down sound effects music so it's not overpowering your voice. 
when you're doing that. And that's just another kind of tip. But so when you decide microphone audio on or off, and then you can tap start recording, or you could just, when you're in this menu, just tap the record button in a record. Now I'm going to switch over to a recording that I'm doing from my phone. Okay, so I purposely left um, that screen up to show you guys that uh, if you don't, like usually it, it's gonna give you a countdown. As soon as you hit record, it's gonna give you like a three second countdown. And I like to usually thumb down the control panel and just be in the game so I don't have to worry about editing that little part out. But I left it here so you guys could see that. Now this is me recording my game. I turned down the sound like I told you guys. I'm gonna go here and the sounds should not be over my voice. I have my phone just sitting right here on my desk in front of me. So you can see how maybe that sounds. I have a, the room is a little more echoey and I'm not using a headphone. I'm just using the mic built in to the phone. There's no, nothing plugged in, but you see I'm recording my phone. And then when I'm done, you're gonna swipe up and you're gonna hit that record button again. And so I'm gonna hit that record button to end the screen and go back to my um, computer recording. All right, so I am done with the recording. And once you hit the stop recording, within a few moments, depending on how long the video, because that determines how big the file is, it takes a while for it to save. But once it saves, you get a little alert. I didn't get the alert to screenshot it for you because I have my notifications off, but you get in a little, you'll get a little alert and it says screen recording, save to your, or save to your phone photos, something similar. So go into photos and here is mine. And it's gonna be just in your photos, your camera roll or your videos folder. And that's where your uh, screen recording will be at. I'll hit play just so you guys can see that this is okay, the same so video I that I recorded. And so it'll save it right to your phone and you are free to send it to your computer to edit, edit to your phone, or if it's just a good to go, you can just, you can edit just real quick if you just need it to trim you can do that from your phone so you can trim it real quick and then just uh upload it straight to youtube i believe you can yeah right there straight to youtube and i'll do maybe a more detailed on how to upload a video if you guys are interested in that let me know in the comments if you're interested in that or just any other type of tutorials that you would like to see me do i know how i record is a big one how I make thumbnails is another big one. But then your video is done and it's right there for you to edit or do whatever you want with. Hopefully this was a, a simple tutorial. I feel like you can see kind of the quality between the two. I feel like it's pretty much the same, you know, recording from your phone or recording from, you know, a, a recording, um, I can't even think of a word, a capture card or whatever it is, or software that captures your screen, a screen recording software. Uh, the only downside to um, maybe doing it like this is that you can't record your face if you want it to, but um, that's the only like downside I can think of it. But here you can record it. You want to just share your gameplay. You want to just be able to post it somewhere. Or maybe you want to record something totally different, unrelated to um, games on your phone screen. Now you know how to. Like I said, let me know if there's any other tutorials you would like to see on how to record on anything with YouTube or recording with your phone. I'll do, I think I already know I'm going to do like a screenshot. That should be a quick one. Um, my thumbnails and maybe editing if you guys would like that also. As always, guys, thanks for watching and I will see you all in the next video.